quite frankly, they're poor. That's probably what's going on. They're pretty fucking poor. Now, yeah, you know, there's a couple routes you can go with this. There's, uh, you know, the generic, generic route, generic deal, which I could present you. And then we have a, something yeah. a little more spicy that maybe Pete could uh, present you. But the first things first, I mean, are you interested in taking a route with Wu Chang still? Um, potentially, yeah. It depends what kind of what route that would be. I don't think that necessarily like an, a simple artist deal signing here would be the best thing to do. Because obviously I've got ties with Tommy before I got to the city, you know, um, and I've got a lot of respect for the, the boys over there. So I kind of did of say to them I, I wouldn't sign as Wu Chang as an artist. And the reason that was the case is because I feel like you guys are already kind of in a really, really good spot. Um, I'm still going to be able to offer myself to you guys for you know shows or events or whatever it may be. Yeah. yeah. And also still work with people. So I was very kind of like thinking you guys are exactly where you need to be. Whereas Mandem Records, I think do need a bit of guidance, a bit of help in that direction. Um, so that's why I, just, I kind of was thinking that the artist deal maybe wouldn't work over here. Um, you know, but obviously I just spoke to Pete briefly and he kind of did plant some seeds in my head that were pretty, pretty yeah. exciting. Yeah, so me and Kay was talking and we was, uh, Kay's always thought about having a, like a sister label. So we yeah. was, uh, we was wondering if uh, that would interest you, you know, being able to have a branch off Wu Chang, you know, so a label you could, uh, you can kind of head up the same way I kind of head Wu Chang here. Yep, yeah. exactly. And we wouldn't be like, you know, watching over your shoulder and shit. It would just be more of, uh, you'll have a bigger machine behind you, backing you as well for, for the times where you need it. But in general, you'll you'll be in charge of everything that goes on at your label. Sweet. And how would that actually, I mean, first and foremost, that sounds like a, a definitely a dream of mine. I mean, Elle, Elle and I spoke about, uh, no matter what happened with the label decision, whether, you know, Wu Chang or Mandem, long term, you know, a record label was something that we would love mm -hmm. to do uh, and we did the event you know kind of ourselves we had support from Wu Chang and and then records obviously as well but we kind of set that whole event up you know sort of independent it went really well so we've definitely got what it takes to kind of build a team and build a label slash company slash something big in a city um so it's de it is definitely something within scope um how, how would it work exactly though and how would the record label kind of would, it, would we be able to try and figure our way to then get the tapes done or what, what how, how would it actually look like i got an idea for that p um Actually, what you said earlier. So, a possibility, uh, one of the options would be we have a floor uh, constructed, a, an extra floor added to this building here, which would be, let's just say, you know, Don Records. So, the flat whole floor would be Don okay. Records. You could have whatever you want in there, a lounge, a studio, office, whatever. Um, and essentially, you would use our services uh, to do whatever you need. Recordings, tapes, uh, merchandise, all that stuff. Yeah, so it'd okay. be a bit like uh, you still have access to the uh, major label services, like everything, all, uh, our teams, our editing teams, merchandise teams, our promotion teams, but it's for your label, you know? It'll still be your label yeah. and how you want to do things. That, that sounds sick, to be fair. That sounds really cool. That would that'd be, that'd be something good we could work towards. Um, and one thing I would ask, obviously, because I'm a bit tangled now with the, with the fandom records, and I definitely don't want to disrespect them guys there. Um, what would it, what would the outlook be if I was to still want to kind of work with them and kind of help them out with collaborations and events and stuff? Oh, you can I'm still not collab, saying I'd be... For sure. I mean, PP yeah. collabs with them all the time. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. 